and I'm with iConnect showing their new tabletop 808 heat pump training unit. This unit has everything you need to show the student all the refrigeration cycle, including we've got your compressor and your metering device, and this is also a heat pump, so we have a reversion valve as well. What's really exciting about this is that this has the R290 refrigerant. It's also got an inverter compressor and it's got an electronic expansion valve that goes both ways for heating and cooling. It's got your condenser coil, your evaporator coil, and it's also got variable speed fans. So this is up to date, ready to go. And we have control over the inverter compressor over each variable speed fan so that we can create low airflow scenarios. We can also create compressor capacitance on there and we can show how the efficiency changes on it as well. Here we switch it from heat to cooling. Now here we're gonna have a calibration going on with our electronic expansion valve. And while you're waiting for it to get calibrated and start up, you can have the students come over here and identify all the components of the refrigeration cycle. Now, as you can see, they're nicely labeled. We have the evaporator, evaporator fan, the condenser, condenser van, and so on. Everything's labeled, but look at this. I love this. We're gonna take these labels off. And there's more down there, and you can just hand them to the students, and now they have to go and label it themselves. So that's really, really cool. Now we're already started up. The compressor's running. We're in the cooling mode, and as you can see, now the student can see the condition of the refrigerant moving through the system. And then when we change modes, they can see how it switches through the heat pump as well. So I'm gonna go over here and I'm gonna change this frequency right here. And that's actually speeding up the compressor. And then we can actually slow it back down. So here you have all the latest technology, you have the current refrigerant in the system, and you have an operating live model heat pump. And now you have everything you need to teach your student about the heat pump refrigeration cycle.